Local news about local people. This is Newslink Indiana. Good evening, I'm Chris Bavender. Thanks for joining us. Across the country this week, police officers are honoring those who have lost their lives on the job. Newslink Indiana's Michelle Deneen was there as one East Central Indiana Post paid their respects. All present or counted. Post. Indiana State Troopers gathered at the Red Key State Post Wednesday to honor fellow officers killed in the line of duty. Today, to honor our departed comrades, to perpetuate the memory of our dead. Families, friends, and officers stood in silence as the names of 42 Indiana State Troopers of the past. Trooper William R. Dixon, South Bend, assigned Dunes Park, appointed September 1, 1935, died June 28, 1938, of gunshot wounds. In the present, Trooper Jason E. Beal, Shelbyville, assigned Bremen, died January 15, 2000. Were read to the crowd. Ceremonies like the one today only happen once a year. But a memorial like this one outside the Red Key Post is a constant reminder not only of officers fallen, but also of friends lost. The last five, um, you know, I talked to shortly before they died, you know, so uh, uh, yes, it, it does have a little more of an impact. In Red Key, Michelle Deneen, Newslink, Indiana. While state students could pay more to attend the university next fall, the Board of Trustees will discuss a 4% tuition hike in an upcoming meeting. The meeting is set for 2 o'clock this Friday at the Ball State Student Center. Students are welcome to attend. Acting President Beverly Pitts says the tuition hike will help strengthen the campus. Currently, in-state students pay $5,600 per year. With the increase, they would pay just over $5,800. And now here's Nicholas Ferreri with a look at tomorrow's forecast. Nicholas. Thanks, Chris. For tonight, mostly clear skies with a low of 55 degrees with winds from the south at 7 miles per hour. High pressure in control of our weather pattern for the next couple of days. That sinking air won't allow too many clouds to form, but we will see some on Friday as well as a chance of some rain showers. For tomorrow, though, no rain in the forecast. We'll see a high of 84 degrees, a nice sunny day with winds from the south-southwest at 12 miles per hour. Chris, back to you. Thanks, Nicholas. That is Newslink Indiana. Join us at 627 tomorrow morning for more news and get local news about local people 24 hours a day at newslinkindiana.com.